Well, it is the nation's largest state and one of the least populated. It is full of beautiful scenery and great family activities. So today we're talking about Alaska with the AAA's Megan Saxon, and she is here to tell us that it's a great travel destination, and you're going to tell us how we can go there as well. That is accurate. Welcome to Sonoran Living. Thank you. Okay, so my first question, what is the weather like right now in, in Alaska? So the weather right now is beautiful in Alaska. Alaska is going to range anywhere from your 60s up to your mid-80s when you get into the, the full summer months. So as we get into July, August, that's when it's getting up into the 80s? Yeah. Okay, so I would think that's what makes it a great travel destination, but it I'm sure is. you've got more for us. It is a great travel destination for the weather, but it's just a really fun place for the family to go. There's a lot of activities, anything from whale watching, zip lines, um, and then my personal favorite, the Great Alaskan Lumberjack Show. And explain that. Uh, it's, <laughs> there is actually a lumberjack series that um, they have events, so the axe toss, um, log climb, log rolling, and uh, they put on a great show. It's, it's very interactive and a lot of fun. Yeah, I would think that the kids would really like seeing yes. that. Uh, what do you think the best way is to see Alaska? Well, the coastline of Alaska covers about 2% of the state, and uh, the best way to see that, um, the only way to see that really is a cruise. That's what I would think. <laughs> and then uh, they do have some great inland options as well. And how, what's the best way to see that? Uh, through a cruise tour. So you can do generally seven days along the coastline, and then add on some nights going into um, McKinley, Denali, and along the corridor. Now, have you been to Alaska before? I have been to Alaska several times. Oh, my goodness. Is that part of your job? It is part of oh my job. Oh, my gosh. We're going to take you out on, <laughs> on your way out of here. Um, talk a little bit about what we're seeing right now. Did, uh, tell me you took these pictures on um, your last This trip. one I actually I didn't. But uh, this is a moose. Uh, well, thank this, you for that. See, uh, <laughs> you're going to see this uh, inland Denali. So when you're going into the mountains and, um, and venturing a little bit into the heart of Alaska, you'll, you'll see wildlife like this. Look at bears. the color behind that moose. Yeah, whale watching. Um, so this is uh, when you're out on the ocean, there are uh, whales and other uh, wildlife that you'll get to see um, sea lions, otters. I mean, it sounds like you're really experiencing everything as you're on the coastline, and then when you go in, I mean, the, the wildlife that you see it's, yeah, is amazing. Abundance, yes. Um, so this is a glacier. This is actually Tracy Arm. Um, so one of the glaciers that you would see in Alaska. So uh, the most popular is Glacier Bay National Park, uh -huh. and that is the largest. But the cruise lines also visit uh, Tracy Arm and Hubbard Glacier is another popular one. Well, you know, it's so hot here in Arizona that I, I would hope that you would say right now is the best time to visit Alaska. Yes, uh, summer is the best time, and it, it really is the good time to go. So May through September, and um, the shorter months, May and September, you're going to find your better deals, mm -hmm. and um, you'll also find a little bit milder weather, but it's Alaska, so the weather can change. Right, you never know. You never know. All right, so you guys are hosting an Alaska cruise in September, we and we're are. trying to get people all excited about that. Tell um, me what's going on. We're very excited about this. We're actually hosting a cruise it's, um, on the MS Zandam, and it's going from Anchorage down to Vancouver, so stopping in Juneau, Ketchikan, and uh, it's with uh, Dan Davis. Oh yeah, okay. Um, so he's a lot of fun to travel with and we'll have um, exclusive shore excursions. We have a lot of onboard activities and uh, a really good time venturing out into Alaska. So how long is the cruise? It's a seven night cruise mm -hmm. and so um, we'll also hit Glacier Bay National Park in that seven night. So is it, you think this is geared towards families or adults? I mean, you know, certain cruises you expect different things. So what do you think? And Alaska is just a family destination. Mm -hmm. So it's actually good for everyone. If you're traveling with a spouse, with your family, with friends, um, being that it is a short season, it's just a really good time to go. Yeah, and it's far enough away that you can really plan for it, being yes. that it's in September. Yes. All right, Megan, thank you very much. It was great seeing some of those pictures and, and wishing that we were somewhere <laughs> besides this heat. Thank you for having um, me. Thank you. We have the information up on our website, uh, AAA Travel. You can give them a call at 877- 731-3926 or triple A or, or yeah, AAA.com forward slash travel.